Alright, you'll have to excuse the messy workshop, but uh, one thing I wanted to test out. Uh, somebody was talking about using rubbing alcohol to remove tar. And this is just one of my bags. Uh, and the tendency is for these bags to get a little bit of tar on them as you dump them in. If they touch the sides of the uh, lid or the hopper, then they will get tar on the bag. And then later that will transfer to your hands. So I'm not really interested in cleaning all my bags, but... Um, since I, do, I don't have a good source of tar right now, this is pretty much the only tar that I can get my hands on at the moment to test this out with. So this is some old tar. You can see it's on there pretty good. I mean, you can scrape it off slowly, but uh, it's 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 tar. Uh, it's 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 on there good. Uh, it will come off on your hands. You can see my hand is fairly clean. warmer day. Yeah. Okay, so I'm not getting that much on it from here. So this tar is actually fairly cold, so it's it's sticking to the bag. It's staying fairly solid. So what I wanted to test out was uh, just dipping a little bit of rubber and alcohol onto a paper towel. Okay. And just see what happens. I have not tested this before. Okay. So... Let me see if I can set this up properly. Okay. So, here is a spot. I don't know if you can see this, see this whole area here. And I'm just going to get a clean part of the rag, get some rubbing alcohol on it, and start wiping this down and see what happens. Okay, so you can see, after just a little bit of rubbing, that came remarkably clean. Um, so uh, kudos to whoever mentioned that. I think it might have been Carl. Carl's in. Rubbing alcohol does the trick on tar, at least when it's that tar on that bag. Now, I have not tried it on my hands yet. Like I said, I am currently in between gasifiers, so I don't have a... A source of tar to get it onto my hands with and honestly I'd be a little <laughs> I'm still a little bit nervous about putting tar in my hands specifically to take it off again uh, using another method but I will be trying the rubbing alcohol in the future because I think it could work really well and uh, there you go I mean that's that kind of speaks for itself that was just a paper towel a little bit of alcohol and uh, a little tar that got cleaned off there so there you go. Thanks for watching.